Hi everyone, it's Kev here from TDN Tools. Today we're going to be reviewing the TDN tool cart. Um, many of you may have seen this uh, out on the road or on uh, you know, different videos. Um, but today we're just going to go through some of the features of the cart. Uh, it comes in two different sizes. This is a smaller cart, um, so we're going to go through that today. So there's plenty of places for everything you'd need. Um, places here for a tip holder, your tap downs to be laid in, for a slide hammer to be positioned tools to be hung on the side. You have five holes here for the longer tools that won't fit in anywhere else. Places for your hammers and for your tab holders and numerous different pockets for anything you may wish to take with you. Um, you can get extra brackets which will enable you to hang tools on the other side of the cart as well. Um, but what's a great feature about this is everything will pack down into this so it also becomes um, a shipping case so you can ship your tools anywhere um, or indeed put them in your car and take them wherever you need to go. So I'll show you how this all breaks down now. So first of all we're just going to remove some tools from the top here. Put these into these. Put that down a second. So these will actually fit in the underside. Slide them down. Okay, these are able to be removed very, very easily, keeping all of the tools in place, enabling you to quite effortlessly put them back at the bottom of the cart. Just back in there. And likewise with this one here. Pop that in the other side. So now all of our tools are complete in the cart itself. So what we'll now do is release these latches on the legs here, both sides. And these legs will actually drop down inside the cart itself, like this. And then the same the other side. So enabling whole lid to be dropped in and our top to be fastened securely using the twist kit at the end. And that enables us now, the wheels do detach from the bottom of the cart as well um, and they can go inside the cart for, for moving around but then you do still have these wheels here so that you can lift the cart and roll around like so. So wheels are nice and easily detached on the bottom of the cart here. You can see these two well, spring clips in all four corners. We just literally push this spring clip down and then the wheel or the caster slides off quite easily and can be fitted in the bottom of the tool cart so everything's together. When you get back, when we're putting the tool cart back together, pop it in one side, just push down, and then it clips into place nicely. Uh, always remember, try and have the two brakes on the same end, it's kind of easier for, for moving around. I'm just gonna show you how uh, quick and easy it is to rebuild it. So first of all, just lock the casters down. This enables it to be tilted over in a much easier fashion. Undo the clips. It's a quick note to them, these can be padlocked as well. So if you are traveling uh, on a flight with these, you can padlock the case. Keep your tool secure. Let's pop the lid off. Okay. Now, just lift up the two, put them down there. Latches in on all four legs. And the tools we removed earlier can now be put back together with these.
So as you can see, very quickly, we're up and ready, and back to work. I hope you enjoyed the tool review of the TDN tool cart. For more information on this tool, please visit www.tdntools.com or why not subscribe to our YouTube channel to see many more reviews like this of latest tools.